This is a book called Pure Mathematics, and it's a classic book. Course of Pure Mathematics, and it's written by G. H. Hardy. This is the same Hardy who invited Ramanujan to England, right? This is the same person who wrote this book. 1948, printed in Great Britain at the University Press, Cambridge. First edition was 1908. Wow. Wow. Hardcore. Hardcore. I'm just going to smell it here. Just even the cover smells good. I'm just going to give it a whiff. This is... It's very hard to get um, the earlier editions. Uh, this book is uh, very well sought after, I feel like. It's not super easy to get it. Um, there's reprints available. I'll try to leave a link in the description in case you want to look for a copy of this book. Real variables, functions of real variables, complex numbers, limits of functions of a positive integral variable, limits of functions of a continuous variable, derivatives and integrals. Hmm. Starts with rational numbers. Right here, it's right at the very beginning of the book. It says, a fraction r equals p over q, where p and q are positive or negative integers, is called a rational number. We can suppose, one, that p and q have no common factor, since if they have a common factor, we can divide both of them by it, okay? And two, that q is positive, since if it was negative, you would just get that, okay. To the rational numbers thus defined, we may add the irrational number zero by taking p equals zero. Okay. Then we start some theory. G. H. Hardy style. Let me zoom in a little bit here. There we go. Irrational numbers. More stuff on irrationals, more stuff on irrationals. Relations of magnitude between real numbers. Algebraic operations with real numbers. A lot of stuff here, right? A lot of mathematics. A lot of mathematics that you've probably never seen. Um, or maybe you have, but just not in this way. Rawls theorem for polynomials. So you get a lot of math with a book like this. It's got a lot of topics. There's an appendix at the end. Some exponential stuff here, logarithmic functions. Hyperbolic functions. Integration by parts. I mean, so much, so much mathematics uh, in this book. Yeah, it's by Hardy. Just thought I would show you this book.